How's it going? We're going to do a launch live today. I went to bed with a wet head and it's like self-sabotage. Um, I'll just be too tired or the kids will have taken the hairbrush up to their rooms or something and I don't want to go walk upstairs. So I'm like, oh, I'll just go to bed without brushing it out or putting anything in it. And I wake up the next day and it's crazy or I just throw it into a bun. So that's what happened. So if this ever happens to you, um, if you don't want to have to live in a bun uh, for the until you wash your hair next, I'm going to teach you the easiest way to tame your wild and crazy hair. So two things, um, glass hair by launch. This is a thermal heat protectant. Uh, it's a blowout primer, but when you put it on your hair, it's heat activated and it activates shine. It makes your hair smooth and sleek. If you are frizz prone like me, so good. And then a La Volume. They have several different styles. They have different shapes. Um, to be honest, it doesn't matter which one you get. They work amazing. Some give you a little extra lift. Some give you a little more fullness. But, I mean, just get one of them. Like, it doesn't matter. Uh, I use these on my kids. I use these on myself. Um, it does take about a minute and a half for this plate to heat up that's on the back. So, if you're trying to get a shapely blowout, kind of account for that. You can use it on wet or dry hair. It's so good. Okay, here we go. Let's do the unveiling. Uh, it might not be as bad. No, it's going to be bad. Okay, so um, I have straight hair that is prone to frizz and um, it's really not as tangly as it could be, uh, but it couldn't go out of the house looking like this. This is my uh, post and it is actually pretty tangly in the back. Um, my hair just naturally <laughs> looks like, I guess I sleep hard. I have no idea. I have a daughter that she wakes up and she looks like just this beautiful princess. Her hair is so smooth and sleek and shiny. Just the texture of her hair. It's like someday she doesn't even have to brush it. She didn't get that from me. Um, okay, so share this video, comment, share below. I'm gonna do an Amazon gift card giveaway today. So um, there are tons of sales happening on Lonja's website. I have the link right here. I'm going to pin it in case there's anything you want. Um, it's like up to 70% off different deals. Um, some tools, 30 to 50% off, like just big sales happening. Um, these make great stocking stuffers, great teacher gifts, great one size gifts that you don't have to worry about, you know, I don't know if it's not going to fit them, etc., etc. Okay. So the way I do this is I'm going to spray glass hair all over my hair. I'm going to show you the simplest way. Um, I could go through and I could start at the bottom, work my way up and brush, but I'm going to do that anyways when it's turned on. So it's just like, if you're in a hurry, I'm not actually in a hurry today. Um, but if you were, I, it's just good to know you don't have to like get all your tangles out then dry. Okay. So we're just going to do it just like I would if I'm like, oh no, I have an appointment but I don't want to look like this. <laughs> um, if your hair looks like this in the mornings, drop a lion emoji. Um, okay. So I have one child that has, so I have four kids total. If you're new to following me. Um, and one of them has the same hair texture. Her name's Lola. She has the same hair texture as me. Um, I have clean hair. I'm not a dirty person. I literally just, uh, went to bed with a wet head and this is what I woke up like. So, um, it is not like exaggerated. It is not, I didn't tease it. If I did, I'd be a million. It is just simply, this is how my hair does, um, wet if I don't brush it. Then I wake up with it like this and I'm like, we got to get to school and I throw it up and it's like, okay, we're just going to be this mom. And then I'm like, but do I want to be this mom? for the next four days because I don't wash my hair every day. No, but, or do I need to wash my hair and start completely fresh? Mm -mm. This is gonna solve your problems. Okay, um, you can use this generously. It comes out in the finest mist. So I use a good bit of it. You can use it on wet or dry hair for the glass hair. 
Yay, Rachel, you got your glass here and you love it. It really is so good. Okay, if you're kind of in a hurry, you could go ahead and start this, like preheat your volume, and you could go ahead and start it and have it going so that plate's getting hot um, while you're spritzing your hair. I didn't do that. I have plenty of time to be able to brush through my hair. Um, it does have a scent to it. It's like a, I don't even know what you would describe it. Like it's just fresh, clean scent. Um, you'll get compliments. People will be like, your hair smells so good. Um, but it's not like an overpowering smell. It's just like a fresh, clean. <laughs> this happens to you when you go to bed for a wet head and now you, uh, dry your hair before you go to bed. I know I just didn't have the energy. I didn't have it. And a lot of times I do let my hair air dry and if I'll brush through it and I'll put some serum in it or blow it out or whatever, then it's like beautiful. Uh, yes, it smells so good. Okay, here we go. Comment, um, tag a friend. For every friend you tag, you'll have more in for every friend you tag, you'll have more entries for the Amazon gift card. Um, we are going to do a big, big giveaway on my page. So be looking for it. I've got a reel going out. It's going to be like a Louis Vuitton bag, like launch stuff, tons of my favorite products. Um, really good, like Lululemon stuff. Um, just a huge, like $3,500 giveaway. And, um, so be on the lookout for that. Make sure you follow my Instagram, Courtney Swan and my Facebook page so that you don't miss out. Um, and we're going to do like this huge Christmas giveaway. So, all right. Getting it warm. So the best way to not damage your hair, if you have a lot of tangles is start at the bottom and work your way up. So small section, what I love about this is it has boar bristles and it has these little slick bristles. So the boar bristles evenly distribute oils throughout your hair and these little strip, like slick bristles make it to where it just slides right through. I do have incredibly tangly hair. This is actually my go-to tool or brush if my hair is tangly or my kids hair is tangly, even if I didn't have it turned on. Seriously, I have gotten so many brushes stuck in my hair over my life and this thing just slides through like butter. I've never gotten tangled in it. It is fantastic and so you need it. Okay, so like that's all not tangly anymore. That easy. I do start at the bottom and work my way up. But this brush is like crazy good. Like, it will just make it to where the slides right through. I'll just add in more of my hair. Again, it takes about a minute and a half for that plate to heat up. So you'll notice when it's good and hot because as you're using it, your hair is just gonna kind of straighten. I just kind of like put it in my hair and rotate towards the back. But any of these little cowlicks, same thing. Let's go ahead and detangle everything and then we'll, keep, we'll actually like blow it out. If you have kids who are tender headed, this tool's so good because it doesn't hurt and it just gets all those tangles out so easy. Also, if you have tender headed yourself or kids, if you grab your hair at the base, kind of like that, and then it doesn't tug at the scalp, that's a good way to get those big tangles out. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Now all my tangles are out really easy. Just gonna separate my hair into sections. 
little more glass here because when the heat hits this, it's just gonna make it so nice and smooth. You can already tell I did this side quickly versus this side that I didn't do. Is that not crazy? you want. If you want more lift, lift up towards the ceiling as you're blowing it out. This is going to give you a lot more lift. You can rotate. Just smooth everything. I just hold my hand here. Ta-da! Get a nice little lift going. Okay, here's an example. See how my hair is not on the plate? Make sure all your hair is on the plate or that part won't, won't straighten. If you have frizzy, crazy hair, you need a LaVolume. This is the LaVolume Elevate, but they have several different types. I do like this one. I feel like that little point is kind of like a good pick. The thing is, if you have crazy frizz prone hair, you know that brushing your hair out and straightening it alone will just make you look like a frizz ball. And this takes that away. I just kind of rotate just a little. It has a swivel cord so you never get tangled. So I can show that little back section. It's done. And it's also heat protecting. Yeah, so good. Okay, next little section. Here we go. It is fast, it is easy. If I wasn't talking and hanging out with you, can do this in no time flat. I'm just gonna go ahead and do half. So Veda is almost two and yesterday she was like poop, poop, but she'd not pooped. So I was like, do you need to poop on the potty? She's like, yeah. And we've done this like, you know, a million times, but she pooped on the potty. Then today she did the same thing, put her on the potty and she peed in the potty and she's peed in the potty twice today. So I'm like, is this a fourth baby thing? Like, is she just potty training herself? I have no idea. Such a big deal. Also, Adam's so cute. He's, like, taking pictures of her, like, by her potty, like, with her book. It's a big day. It's a big deal. Okay, go into this section. Put a little more glass here. Again, I do like this one because it has that more of a tri teardrop. I guess it's not really a triangle. But I can get a lot of volume and then I just feel like it kind of, I don't know. I like the way it shapes my hair. Okay, now I'm gonna rotate and go towards the back. Just this way, making it nice and smooth. Isn't that exciting? So I'm like, so I, my oldest turns 15 this month, so, and then I have an 11 year old and a nine year old, um, and then the baby. And so, I just feel like I've been in the diaper phase for um, about a decade and a half. So, at least a decade. Um, I had a little gap in between, you know, her, like a several year gap, but uh, between her and the middle, but it's like, whoo, diapers are expensive and stinky. Okay, look how smooth and sleek. Literally does all the work for you. 
looks like your hair is healthy and it's soft like the actual texture of my hair changes when I use glass here and this tool I typically have hair that is so coarse and thick it feels like horse hair that's just kind of like before I put all this in it and before I started using this even today like it's like can't get your hands through it feels like horse hair really thick hair and when I do this like you guys I'm telling you if you've got it works great on thin fine hair as well you do want to make sure your hair is about 80 percent dry before you use a low volume in general so if you're using it to dry your hair make sure your hair is actually either air dried or you dried it with a blow dryer up to 80 percent and then you can use this it isn't if you have fine thin hair maybe that wouldn't make a difference for you but for me with my thick hair okay that's what i need all right so here we go you can kind of tell the difference even on camera here like the texture of the hair is like wiry and then I use a little volume and it isn't I've gone my whole life having hair that's like unless I really do a lot with it or have to like manage it like style it curl it straighten it all these things it didn't like it doesn't just wake up beautifully um and using this now for the next several days I will have I will sleep on this and I can now go five to seven days in between washing and my hair doesn't get wild and crazy. It will stay like this for the next five to seven days. If I curl it, it'll hold curl. It just won't be like, you know, I don't know, whatever this is. Okay, so here we go. So our elves last night, we do elf on the shelf. And so our elves have been kind of tired lately. We do elf on the shelf and the... Our elves have been like moving, but just kind of moving around the kitchen, not really getting into anything crazy. And my nine-year-old's like, our elves are so no fun this year. So then I was like, they're just probably so tired from traveling from the North Pole. It's just so tiring. And so last night I got out like all these Hershey Kisses and I had one, we have three elves. I had one elf like diving into a bowl. I had another elf with just like Hershey Kisses wrappers everywhere. And then I took these uh, tiny little bites out of the Hershey Kiss. And so it looked like it had been like chewing all over it. And then I like wipe, they're like white chocolate, like wiped it all over its face and put it in its hand. And then I did another elf like climbing up a, like our cases in our pantry, like our little drawers and then like little things on top. And she was so excited. And so I was like, okay, I can like, you know, some days our elves are going to be tired and some days our elves are going to get into things. And so Anyways, if anybody else, you've started your elves yet and um, they're like maybe not keeping up to all your, the other ones, I get it. I feel you. Um, and so uh, I also lost our baby elves. I don't know where they're, they're in the shed somewhere, but I've looked and looked and I can't find them. Um, and so I ordered a little baby elf that's pink and we've never had a pink baby elf before. And so I'm going to come up with like this story about our baby elf. And like I'll write out a little story that like maybe it's their little sister or that they had a baby or their all their grandchild or something. I don't know. I'll have to come up with something fun. Um, but core memory for my kids was when like our elves had baby elves and our baby elves did wild things and so like toilet paper everywhere or whatever. Um uh but anyways, do you guys have any traditions like holiday stuff that you do with your kids? Growing up, we did uh, something called hide the pickle at my grandma's house and every Thanksgiving we would decorate our Christmas tree and we would hide a pickle ornament. She would hide it and whoever found the pickle ornament, she gave them an early Christmas present. It was really fun. And so that's something that like we love to do as well. Um, your elves need a pet. They have them at Walmart. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine? Um, so funny. That would be so cute. I need to go to Walmart and look. Okay. Here we go. It's also the first year that Lexi, who's 11, she was like, hey mom, don't forget to move the elves tonight. And I was like, what? And she was like, yeah, don't forget to move them. And I was like, what do you mean? They moved themselves. And she's like, mom, I know you moved them. And I was like, she knows. And she was like, but I'll still like pretend. And I was like, so sad. But the 
um, nine year old, she's still like totally into it. And so now I'm letting the 11 year old help me with like ideas and she's really liking that. And then obviously Veda just is angry. She can't touch him, but it's like such a bitter, like sweet watching your children grow. Like there's so much of it. That's really awesome that you're like, I'm just so proud of like the human they're becoming just like love seeing their personalities. And then there's also like something so like sad about your kids getting older. So sad. Okay, we're finishing, I promise. Okay, share this video, comment, share below. I'm gonna pick a winner for an Amazon gift card giveaway. Um, how easy, here we go. All right, so this is just easy little blowout. Um, I did want to thank you guys for any time you click my links, shopping my stuff, um, clicking any of my like launch stuff. If you're on my page and you click a link, um, in some way it comes back around that the cyber world knows like, Hey, Courtney sent you. Um, and, uh, so I'm trying to do a giveaway every single live between now and Christmas. And then, um, try I've been trying for like the last six months to do a giveaway on most of them just as a thank you for like, I really do appreciate that you tell your friends about me. Um, I have so many people who are like, Oh, my friend like recommended you or, Oh, sent me this from you. And so, um, just a huge thank you. Like the giveaways are not things that brands give us. It's things we we do. It's just like a thank you because I know there's tons of people you could watch, you could follow, or you can like share about, but I really do thank you guys for like, it makes it to where I can spend my day like making content for you, outfit ideas, like I can buy the things and show them. And then it allows, like, it's just such a good like, hey, thing. And so, um, but I really do appreciate it. And, um, I also am like such a big deal girl. Like I genuinely love finding deals for y'all and finding really good hacks that can help your life be um, easier and better and that you don't feel like quite, it is just hard to be a woman. It's hard to be a mom. Um, it's hard, all those things. And so I feel like if I can help you feel like <laughs> not as crazy, like, I don't know. And that here's a few simple things. If you implement this, this will make your like, daily routine a little easier or better. Um, I love getting to do that. So, um, okay, I'm gonna, I missed one spot right here. And just since I'm gonna use this for like the rest of the week, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. But we're, we're like almost done. Notice any little palettes. Okay, if you wanted to spray it, you could. If you want to put marula oil in it, you can. I normally do. It allows you to get texture and shine without getting frizzy, and it smells amazing. So whereas typically if I did that, my hair gets fluffier. If I put a little marula oil in it, it doesn't. It just kind of like lays, but, but separates. So it's just the marula oil by Launch. Launch does have huge cells going on. You can save like up to 70% on some things, up to 50% on some tools, 30%. Um, it's just so good. This would take me about five to six minutes to do my hair start to finish maybe even less, um, if I'm really focused. Uh, it's just the easiest way I found to tame my wild hair. It does take longer when I do it live because I'm chatty. <laughs> um, but, oh, Cindy. She said, I always buy my lawn stuff with your link. I hope that helps. I recommend it my sister. She also buys with your link. Yes. So that's, I know the internet is so weird to know how it works, but it totally helps. Like if you clicked it, it counts. And, um, 
on anything that you bought. And so um, it makes it to where I get to do these with you guys and all the other things that we do. And so um, I literally like growing up, I wanted to be a mom, which I obviously am. But if there was this available, I would have loved to have gotten to do it. And I just am so grateful. And so um, hopefully we can like give back to you guys as well. We're also starting a nonprofit soon to help like single moms and to help like uh underprivileged like children like with jackets and shoes and different things and like um stuff that we're going to be able to do and I literally like could not um be able to do the things that we do like if it wasn't for you guys and so I'm just so like grateful that I feel like God has like connected my path with so many people that have like poured into me or made connections or like it's amazing to think that you're you can cross a path with someone on the internet and somebody you've never met but you feel like you're friends or um I don't know it's just incredible and so uh I just look forward to like I don't know like really hopeful for the future I know there's a lot in our world going on but I just currently feel really hopeful and then also excited like as a community of like what will we get to do together next? You know, like, will we have more kids? Will we not? Who knows? Will we just keep talking about potty training and like all the other fun stuff? Or will we get to make like, I would love at some point to have like a big property that has like little houses on it that women who are fleeing domestic violence get to come and get on their feet and we help pour into them and that it just helps them. Like I know when my sister was going through that, she didn't have a safe place. And then when I was going through things, like I... Being a, it was like the hardest season ever and so um I there isn't a lot of things that help mom with their kids and I don't know there's just a lot of things we have a big like heart to want to um see changed like in our community and kind of across the country and so I'm excited for us to kind of all do that together so we're working on things like that right now and um I don't know it's just great. But anyways, um, kind of a detour from, uh, hair, but, um, speaking of hair, really seriously, if you don't have a little volume and you have crazy hair, it will actually change, <laughs> change your hair life. Um, so, uh, I hope you guys have a good day and, um, I will see you soon. Bye guys.